I can't imagine anyone would be um, inclined to plant the noxious weed. At Greenfield's nursery, experts are often asked how to get rid of a natural nuisance. It's serious stuff. Canadian thistle is the, um, is the weed that I think we often turns up in our gardens and is banned um, and regulated in about, you know, 45 states. An old Maryland law passed back in the 1880s makes it illegal to grow thistle in one's yard. I don't even know what thistles are. <laughs> But it's not the only strange law you'll find on Maryland's books. Some are just downright dumb. Did you know it's illegal in Baltimore City to take a lion into a movie theater? To bring a what? A what? A crime so crazy. A lion. Well, who would want to do that? <laughs> Council can't imagine their predecessors passing it. A lion? Like a, a cat? I mean, a big cat? Well, obviously, I'm hoping elephants, too. I mean, uh... The fact that someone passed it at some point is kind of crazy, but then again, it was a different time. It was, you know, we've got 80 to 100 years, maybe 150 years in some of these cases. Tim Young is a stand-up comic. It's entertainment. With an actual law about. degree. A lot of the crazier laws are brought about by morals of the time. No person shall possess or breed the following species of animals as a pet. He offered to help us Foxes, with research. Trunks, raccoons, all species of bears. That's right, bears are forbidden as pets. No, I never wanted a bear. Bear hugs are okay, but in Hailthorpe, public kissing is forbidden. In the Hailthorpe Charter, it's actually illegal to kiss uh, someone for more than one second, and that's male-female. I'm sure male-male, they probably behead you when they wrote that wall. <laughs> I have to stay out of Hailthorpe. I've only been married 10 years. We're still kissing. But some brave buddies <laughs> now it's on the original charter. break the law <laughs> as they please. The I sure have, because I've kissed her more than one second. <laughs> We do it all the time. <laughs> In Rockville, road rage remains civil. A person may not profanely curse and swear or use obscene language upon or near any street, sidewalk, or highway. Because cursing other cars isn't allowed even by state senators. Not allowed to swear while on the highway. That's interesting. Like in your car, too? <laughs> and how would they enforce that? That's crazy. Back in Baltimore, you can get heated, but you can't throw hay from a second story window. Oh yeah, someone can get hurt. Probably someone was maimed in the 1800s with a hay bale. No, I don't see the point in that no, at all. I don't either. I really don't. I wouldn't I mean, throw a bale of hay nowhere to put it on my garden. Yeah, but how else are you going to get it down to the ground? Yeah. You have to throw it out the window. <laughs> <laughs> These crimes, while outlawed, are so odd and old, they're no longer really enforced. Well, obviously, it's not how these laws are or back in the turn of a century or two ago. But may be still on the books. Kind of crazy, the Bush administration went after uh, Greenpeace with 150-year-old piracy laws that weren't used, so you never know when they're going to come back into effect. A century from now, our modern laws may seem just as silly. There are ordinances that, that have decency laws about wearing your pants below your butt, which I'm sure people will look at later on down the road and be like, what the hell were people thinking? You never know what the future holds, especially in Baltimore City, where fortune-telling is also a crime. By cards, palm reading, or any other scheme, practice, or device, shall be deemed guilty of a misdemeanor, and upon conviction thereof, shall be fined not more than $500 or subject to imprisonment for not more than a year. Basically, if you're a gypsy, they're going to send you to jail. You better tell that to Madam Jane, who's right down here about three blocks. She's been here for about 100 years. In Baltimore, Melinda Roeder. These are things that I guess the society doesn't want. Fox 45, News at 10.